What is this? <laughs> what have you done? What have you done? That's a big fat business word, Ben. One of my best mates, Glenn, has been helping me behind the scenes in the channel and he is honestly the nicest, hardest working guy that I'm lucky enough to have on the team. Okay, so the team might just be me and Glenn. Ben, Squarespace. Where is the video? Quick. Come on. And of course my manager who has kindly reminded me this video is actually sponsored by Squarespace which leads me very nicely onto my next point. The reason why I'm traveling to Dubai is I'm starting a videography business for property in the UAE which I'm so excited about. I have work lined up for it. I obviously need to come here to get my work visa which I'm in the process of doing. I am of course going to be living here for a while as well which it, I, I can't believe it's actually happening. This is definitely the biggest life slash career decision I've ever made and I'm so nervous but at the same time excited. So yeah, I'm basically gonna be surprising Glenn with business class tickets with Emirates to Dubai. He has never flown business before, he's always editing my videos where I'm doing business and first, and I feel awful, I feel like he deserves it more than me. Enough of me waffling, let's get the business class flight to Dubai. So the time is currently 5.50, I'm just waiting for my car, it comes included with the Emirates business class. Glenn's booking didn't actually go through, so I had to rebook it about 30 minutes ago, so he's not getting a Mercedes, he's getting a Ford Galaxy, which is actually quite good, because hopefully that won't give away the fact that we're flying business, he obviously has no idea, I'm so excited to surprise him with this. Day. What's good everybody? He is here and look how many bags he has. He has two bags. Only two. No need for all this crap. Pack lunch. <laughs> I've got all the equipment with me. That is my excuse. In this squeaky ass bloody suit. <laughs> Oi, it doesn't actually squeak anymore because I sprayed sun cream in the world. <laughs> no sleep. Sleep is for the week. Alright, so there is a queue for business, but there is no queue for economy. Well that is great. We have not cut business. Cheap life, mate. Cheap life, indeed. Uh, you alright? You need our COVID test now? Yeah, okay, cool. Okay, yeah, nice little shot of you, Glenn. Two boarding pass. Let's go to B13 with this bag. Hello, mate. I was asked to drop this off here. What are you looking for? All good? Thank you, mate. Cheers. What is this? <laughs> what have you done? <laughs> what have you done? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> That's a big fat business word, Ben. <laughs> no, I'm not actually pranking, you know. My guy. <laughs> that's sick. Yeah, I'm that is quite sick, stuff, right? Bro. We're flying business, mate. I'm fucking knackered, but I'm like, geez, this is going to be sick. This is why I was telling you to try and get some sleep, because yeah. I don't want you to sleep the whole it's flight. Fine, it's fine. <laughs> Can't tell you how hyped I am. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm so happy. My guy. Mate, I was literally sick. shaking. When she was printing off the tickets, I was so scared he was going to see, but he didn't see until we had to take his bag to the like extra baggage bit. Thank you very much. Cheers, Glenn. Here's to yeah. your first business class experience. I know. And we are leaving the Lufthansa lounge. The time is now 8 a.m. We're on our way to our gate, B47. That is where we're going to be catching our flight. I am so excited for this. The airport is obviously so empty right now. We now have a 15 minute walk to our gate, which isn't too bad. How are you today? It is time, Glenn, <laughs> to go to I'm business thinking, class. Let's see it, mate. Let's <laughs> see it. I'm excited to say the least. You know? I really hope you're going to like this, mate. All the space in the world, mate. All the space in exactly. the world. Exactly. It's funny, though, because typical of flight to Dubai, the business is completely full <laughs> and the economy is empty. That's All a right. professional gear. Thank you. As I mentioned earlier, this video is sponsored by Squarespace, and obviously, I need to make a website to show my portfolio for my videography in Dubai. As you can see, I've been using Squarespace myself personally for a very, very long time now and it's actually really cool to be working with the company. The interface is so easy to use. They have beautiful templates that require no coding skill whatsoever. I've used a lot of website building sites and by far Squarespace has been my favorite and it's also taken me the least amount of time to actually build the site. There are a ton of different quick, easy features to use in the website. Two things I love is the ability to actually add your location so clients of mine or well, potential clients can see that I'm actually based in the UAE. Another thing is I'm able to make a password protected page so I can share work with clients that they don't actually want to be public yet head over to squarespace.com for a free trial and once you're ready to launch your site go to squarespace.com slash ben morris or use the code ben morris to save 10 percent off your first purchase or domain so yeah please make sure you do that it's an amazing site i love them so much anyways i'm now going to stop talking and we are going to catch this flight here we are mate oh my god <laughs> what a treat mate what a treat <laughs> i can't even see your facial reactions because you got your mask on <laughs> Look at these seats. 
Oh my god. This is naughty. <laughs> this is very naughty. <laughs> GS, that stands for Glen Smith. <laughs> there he is. Pick up. I appreciate it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Just chipping with a button. There we go. It took about 20 seconds into flight. Cheers to that lad. Cheers, fella. There you go. Get it down, you. In one. Come on. <laughs> Where does one put one's caviar? I'll tell you. You haven't got the caviar yet. On your tray, mate. Yeah, Get your tray out. Wow, look at that, lads. So I did not know this, but you can literally control your seat from the PSP. I don't know why I'm calling it a PSP, but it actually just looks like one. As you can probably tell, we are now taking off on our way to Dubai. Flight should take about 6 hours 50 and we have just taken off and we are, we are vertical. We are basically vertical. How are you doing there, Glenn? I'm living the dream, mate. Yeah. Hiding behind my little wall. La Gamer Glenn is already on it playing 2048. This is the best game in the world. If you don't know about it, then it's okay. You don't need to know. If you can't get 2048 by the end of this flight, you have to pay for the flight, all right? <laughs> okay, so 78.2% of you guys watching right now are not subscribed. Please, please, can you subscribe? Me and Glenn are trying to get a million this year. I think it's possible. Also, if we can get 50,000 likes, I will fly either a stranger or a subscriber on first class within the next year, obviously when I'm allowed to. For any of you guys interested in how much the flight costs, make sure you follow my Instagram at Ben Morris. I will show you exactly the price in the next couple of days, so go follow me over there. So far, I've got a nice little yogurt. Very nice. Strawberry, I've got some butter, some jam, and some fruit. I'm gonna play a quick game of seeing how fast I can get to sleep while Glenn eats his food. Uh, can I have this, uh... I've got some this. Thank you. I mean, it's still not great coffee though, is it? Oh, is it not? Nah. That's not good. Pity. So I'm currently in the toilet right now, if you can't tell. I think we're about half an hour into the flight. Honestly, those two glasses of champagne have already got to my head just a little bit. I'm a massive lightweight. I am honestly so happy. I didn't think this plane would be the new Boeing 777, but it is. More importantly, I think Glenn is having a great time. Anyways, very necessary toilet review. We don't actually have a window this time, which is very sad, but we do have a nice toilet. There is a very lovely, clean, would affect seat. I don't know who is actually caring about what material they're making the seats out of. There's a sink, a tap, some towels, a shaver plug. Water inside these drawers. All right, nothing interesting. And what about this one? No, absolutely nothing. Anyways, enough of the toilet. Let's go back oh, to our seat. There he is, Glenn looking all cozy. Oh my God. I'm still good. Very good. The most comfort. Oi. <sighs> Yes. He's going and he's gone. I feel like I'm in like a stasis pod. About to be frozen and woken up in a hundred years. So for some reason they made the flight dark in the day, even though it's not a night flight. I'm gonna wait until they open the windows, then I'll probably show you around the seat. What are you doing with the lights, mate? Tell a spooky ghost story. There was once a Boeing 777 that took off. <laughs> Don't you start that. The pilot had a few too many drinks before the flight, but that wasn't what everyone was worried about. Basically what I'm trying to say is I'm going for a very quick nap. I haven't slept in about 30 hours now. I'm so ridiculously tired. I'm not very good at the whole, this whole filming, Malaki. It's your job. All right, so me and Glenn might have fallen asleep for a little bit of time. I think it was probably about an hour and a half. It was a very, very good nap, but we were both absolutely shattered. Ben's been greedy, got the salmon with caviar, yeah. as well as the meze that I got as well, just because, you know. I got two starters. Yeah, is it me or is this chair moving? Is it a massage chair? Food taste test. Tastes like raw salmon, really. I mean, it is raw salmon. Living the dream, mate. Living the dream. How's Thank it going so far? I'm having a great time, you know. Yeah. I've watched. I watched Tenet. Have no clue what it's about. Had a nice nap. Yeah. Honestly, best plane ride I could have ever asked for. So, nice. you know, dream. So I've just got my main course. I've got a seafood curry and Glenn, Where is yours? Yeah, I'm better yet. Uh, no, I've got a lamb kofta though. Oh, so. very nice. Yeah, happy days. And of course. A bit. Get me to spoons. Meal review on Emirates. We have the seafood curry, rice, beans, and what I presume is probably seafood. Thoughts? That is really good. Emirates, well done.
Okay, so they finally put down the plane windows. However, it is now already dark outside. I completely forgot about the time difference, which is so annoying. I'm gonna show you around the seat, everything it has to offer. First, we're starting with this massive TV screen. It's probably about 32 inches, I think. I have a few main buttons down here which control my seat. This is to lie flat. That is to go like semi-flat, I guess. And this is to sit upright. This is to control my TV. This is for the privacy screen to go down. And this is to make it go up. Also, you can control the lighting, but it doesn't make too much of a difference. And here you have a very nice fridge, I guess you could call it. There is a Perrier, I don't know what this is, and a 7-Up. Those two pretty awful drinks, however, a Pepsi, that is a great choice. Here we have this little cupboard where there was two bottles of water. There is only one left because I've drunk the other one. Well, almost drunk it. So you don't get a proper wash bag in this flight, but there is a socks and eye shades bag. Also, there is some very nice little headphones which plug into your TV unit um, as Glenn is showing us. Are they good? Down by your seat, you have two USB ports. You also have a HDMI port in case you bring your Xbox and a UK wall plug uh, socket. As well as that, you have your iPad control device where you can control your seat, the TV, everything like that. And basically the same thing, just in the form of a game controller. All in all, this seat is absolutely amazing. I really didn't expect to be on the new Boeing 777. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think this is the most up-to-date Emirates business class. Without a doubt, it is absolutely amazing. The service, the seat, the comfort, the food. Emirates Business Class, you were absolutely amazing. How was it, mate? Mate, sick experience. Sick out of Glen? Uh, I'll give it a 9 out of Glen. A 9 I'll, out of Glen? A 9 out of Glen. So I'm going to have to take you on first class to get a 10 out of Glen. I mean, uh, maybe <laughs> I set it up like that. Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> so yeah, this is the whole area where all the business seats are. It's a 2 3 2 configuration. So, so, so beautiful and modern in here. And the staff are lovely, as always. So this is the new first class. Look at that floor to ceiling. Sorry, that's Whoa. a joke. That is ridiculous. You've got your whole room in here. A humongous TV. Oh my days. Next one. Do you reckon we can get the same one for both of us? Because I would happily. Just two chairs. I would there. happily get both of us in there, mate. Honestly, this is absolutely Give ridiculous. <laughs> oh my days. All right, which way are you going? Thank, Thank you so goodbye. much. Cheers. Bye bye. Have you. a great evening, guys. Bye. However, there is two more things before I actually end the video. We need to collect the car, which is going to be insane. I cannot wait to show you guys. Oh my days. Glenn, did you hear that? Somehow successfully fit all the luggage in the back of a Toyota Yaris. That is a success. Wow. Well, mate, you happy with your car? It's a nifty little whip, to be fair. It is a thrifty whip. I'm happy I've got an automatic as well, to be fair. I can't lie. You didn't get my joke. You said it was a nifty whip, and I said it was a thrifty whip. How could I fucking mess it? So this is the end of the video. If you did enjoy, make sure you smash a thumbs up down below. Let's try to get 50,000 likes and I will fly either a stranger or a subscriber on first class within the next year. Comment down below some video ideas and also subscribe, please. We're trying to get a million this year. I will honestly, it will just make my life if I can do it. And uh, yeah, all right. See you guys very soon. Goodbye. <laughs>